Hey guys, April Marie here from AprilMarieTucker.com and um, I'm going to shoot a quick video. It's going to be a training tutorial and I'm actually going to allow you to look over my shoulder while I'm walking through, walking you through um, setting up your very own custom capture pages within Facebook and creating your own Facebook tabs. Um, so that way you're able to do some paid marketing if you'd like or even just sharing. It's, it's always great to be able to have your own capture pages and ways for people to find out what you're up to or you know what you provide so you're able to capture leads when they're kind of sniffing around on Facebook because people tend to get a little nosy and they go and they look at all your tabs and look at everything anyways but also if you're doing any kind kind of Facebook marketing and you really you know you really want to take your fan page to the next level you should have you know Facebook tabs you should have Facebook tabs that have capture pages on them with free trainings and free offers and things like that and if you haven't already you can go ahead and join me over on my fan page um, you can simply go to the link. I'll provide a link below, but it's April Marie page, and you can just do a simple search right on Facebook. And you can go check out my tabs and the way I've got them set them up, set up. And I'm going to show you a little bit um, about what I have here, anyways. That way, you're able to see kind of what you're in for as far as training goes, and um, just kind of give you a brief tour of what I have here. So these are all my tabs right there. If somebody drops them down, let's say they're a fan, they're going to come and they're going to look and they're going to click on those or like right here you've got a button right here where you can promote the page now this is called paid advertising so it would be pay-per-click so you know you promote page is actually not really pay-per-click it's just basically you play like a, a flat fee and um, you know it, it basically puts your post out there you know you promote your page in the news feed um, but you can also do pay-per-click where you're showing up on the right hand side here um, and, and also do pay-per-click on these which is a great way if you're looking to generate leads and probably the fastest way one of the fastest ways um, to start getting leads right away in your business is by creating some of these custom tabs that we have here now this one's actually for MLSP and it's one of our profit campaigns and it's um, like a top, top uh, earner's money secrets right here. And so I just plugged that in. I'm going to show you how to do that today. There are some custom ways, that you, uh, custom tabs that you can actually add in apps that you can add right from MLSP right into here. But in this training video, I'm going to show you how to do it without MLSP. So you won't need MLSP to do this. And you'll be able to add your company's um, website. Like I'll show you really quick. I'm actually going to add one of my companies um, today in this video which is going to be pure leverage. We've got a bunch of different little capture pages and I haven't added it yet so I fear this would be a great opportunity to show you how to add it but you know like my company here's um, my price that I have that one actually be just being redirected to the capture page is how I have that and I'll show you how to do it. you got a lot of different options here to play with and this is completely free. This isn't going to cost you any money. Now I've seen tools like this that cost a lot of money and um, it kind of um, scares people because they're like, oh, I have to pay a monthly fee, you know, just to have my capture pages on here. Absolutely not. You do not have to pay a monthly fee. And if you really wanted to get creative, you could actually do your own HTML and you could, you don't have to have capture pages. You can create your own um, if you wanted to really get creative. In this video, I'm not going to get that creative. Um, creating capture pages is um, something I do do, um, but I'm not going to do that. It takes a little bit more time than what I'm allowed in this video anyways. Um, here's just another one just to give you a, kind of an example of what we've got here. And this one actually I did create myself um, using WordPress. So I've got a, a free ebook here that I give away. So I've got a bunch of different things. You know, and the, the key is here is you're actually giving away things. You want to if you if you're gonna capture somebody's name and their email and they're gonna give you the right information, you better give them something in return. They're not just gonna be like, oh, they're gonna sell me something and you know, want to opt in and give you their information. That's not how it works give them something in return something of value something that they want something that they need you know in this case I'm trying to attract home business owners people that want to start a home business um, MLMers network marketers so what am I doing I'm giving them a hundred techniques to increase more sales um, and it's a free download and it's a free ebook of course they're gonna want that and they're probably seeking that so so you want to make sure that you're leading with value so we're gonna um, actually jump on over to my pure leverage here before we get started because I got to pick out a capture page um, which by the way you know pure leverage is a tool suite it's you know very generic tool suite you can use it for any business and you know you can get lead capture pages just like this there's a custom blog and all kinds of stuff um, I'll be sure to leave a link below the video but of course you know it's totally up to you know you whether or not you okay so let's assume maybe you're on my pure leverage team and you don't know where to look for this stuff well here's all your capture pages you've got 
a pretty good amount of different capture pages back here that you can use um, even inviting to you know live conference calls and things like that that you're able to use to promote this business opportunity um, but also be able to make 100% commissions so those are the things that you want to make sure that you're promoting and getting out into the universe and one of the ways is through Facebook. Facebook is a great way for you to do that so I'm going to show you how to do that really quick here. I'm actually, I want to see this one really quick. I haven't seen this one yet. It's new. Um, so easy a monkey can do this. This amazing free video reveals a revolutionary system that allows you to build a money-making list on autopilot and collect 100% commissions by sharing the system with others. Hey, I like that. Uh, most people do. So I'm just going to um, copy this link right here. And uh, we're going to use this one. And first of all, we're going to have to, if you're new and you've never used Woobox, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to just go up to your search bar here on Facebook and just do a search for Woobox, W-O-O-B-O-X, okay? And it's called Woobox Custom Tab. So you're going to want to click on that. And I'll leave a link for this below this video as well. So you're able to find all your tools very easily. So you're able to follow along with this video. Um, so just look for the links right below this video and you'll be good to go. So now what you're going to want to do is just go ahead and click this button, this green button right here that says install page tab. Okay, now I'm going to have to actually install this on another page that I have um, going on here. And page, let's see here. Okay, so I just added it to to my, one of my other fan pages for my, one of my businesses. And um, once you've done that, it's actually going to take you to a page where you can actually create the tab. So now we're actually going to get into the really easy part, actually. This is actually really easy to do. So uh, at least I think it is. You know, you might not, maybe because you're really new or something like that, but it's pretty easy. So now you've got, you know, your tab settings here. Um, I always check this box right here. It says show the share button at the top of the tab. And I'll just show you really quick what that looks like. Um, actually, I'm not going to show you right now. I'll show you later what it looks like once we have it set up where your share tab is. Um, now you're going to just want to use the page source. Now, if you already have a capture page, this is where, you know, it's pretty easy. This is just simple stuff. I'm just going to paste that capture page that I grabbed over at Pure Leverage, this one right here, right into that box right there. Now, once I've done that, I'm going to check this box and, box and say hide, um, hide scroll bars. And we'll be able to adjust it and see what it looks like. We might have to adjust the height. Um, not sure what the, you know, what everything is in pixels on this one. So we'll just have to play with it and see. But at this point, everything's looking pretty good. Fan gate. Now, the fan gate is basically this. Like if somebody, let's say you're doing some paid advertising. And I actually like a fan gate. Fan gates are very nice. I have a fan gate. And I'll show you in a second what it looks like. Um, now, but if you don't have a fan gate, don't worry about it. It's um, not something that you have to have. You can have somebody create one for you, uh, maybe on Fiverr, or you can um, actually create one your own yourself. Just make sure that you, you know, upload it to your WordPress or something, and um, host it on your WordPress. Because all you need is the link. See how I've got here? I've got the free training. Click like because you know. You know, even if they go on, do land on your, your fan page, they might not opt in right away. They might say, you know, yeah, I think I'd just rather like and just kind of see what this person's up to before I give them my information. So you want them to click like so that that way they're able to stay connected with your fan page. That is really critical. So that's why I really like having the fan gate. But like I said, it's completely up to you. You can just have one created just for your, you know, fan page one time and then, you know, they and then you just use it for all of them. You know what I mean? But that's really good for any kind of Facebook advertising that you get non-fan page source and then you just want to check the box that says URL. So once you click on that box right there, you're just gonna paste the you know the URL that you have for your fan page or whatever in there. Now if you're not like sure how to create, maybe you could just do a Google search and see you know how you know how to create a fan gate. Um, that's a lot of time how I learn a lot of things is I just do a Google search and I figure it out. You know, you just figure it out. Somehow you just do it. So there's a lot of information on Google that you're able to, to kind of get. And also, you know, if you're just like I said, just have somebody create it for you and um, go to Fiverr. I mean, for five bucks, you can have that created, what I just showed you. So it's not real expensive. But I do recommend it. But if you want to just get something out there and before you have it done, that's cool too. You don't have to have it. It still works. This all still works in advertising these capture pages. As long as you have a high converting capture page, you will get leads because people will see it and they'll want to offer 
Um, you know, that's a pretty high converting capture page when I just showed you. MLSP has awesome high converting capture pages and all this stuff is already done for you. So you don't have to sit there and be like, oh, I got to create a capture page and I got to learn copy and I got to create sales funnels and videos and all this stuff. I don't recommend you doing that, especially if you're new because you'll probably quit pretty quickly because it's very frustrating. Um, however, you know, if you want to get started with MLSP and have the capture pages and everything that's already done for you, the training, the value, and everything already done for you, I'll leave a link for that below because I highly recommend it. It's where I started. It's how I got started on the internet, and I've been three years on the internet now. Um, you know, I'm part of the. I'm actually an industry-wide trainer at this point in the stage in my in the game. So definitely recommend it. And um, let's continue on with training here. Okay, so you can um, do the tab icon. It's, you know, if you want to create your own image, it's totally up to you. Um, now, the tab image actually needs to be 111 pixels wide by 74 picture, pixels tall. I usually jing something. So if I'm going to create an image, you know, let's say I want to put, um, let's say I'm going to just gonna put Pure Leverage up there. Okay, home of 100% commissions. Actually, I gotta, let's go over to Google Images really quick. Google Images has got a, a lot of great, uh, I mean you can find pretty much anything on the internet, but you just do a search. So if you're in Pure Leverage or if you're in MLSP, if you're not in MLSP, um, you'll be able to do this and um, just simply do a search. And then once you've done a search, then you'll be able to um, pretty much find, you know, all kinds of different pictures right here. So I'm just going to try to find something that is pretty eye-catchy here so that that way it catches people's attention because the idea here is you know red is pretty you know it catches people's eye yellow um, you know stuff like that I don't want anything too flashy I think I think something like this would be pretty good but there's no red in it but I can always fix that too so let's see here let's see what I can do with this let's see save image as and what I normally do is I just open up my soft or you have PowerPoint or you can always get, like if you don't have that, you can always get a free version of PowerPoint. I don't know what it's called, but um, you can just do a search for that too. Um, but I like to use PowerPoint and what I'll do is I'll actually, and you'll need Jing too as well for this, to create this. Okay, so I'm going to actually widen this up here and I'm going to get rid of this. Now, this stuff I just figure out, you guys, and that like, you know, this is just, I'm, I'm not like a techni, technophobe or whatever you want to call it. I'm not like a, a technical person. So I just figure stuff out. So I'll just put it that way. I just figure this stuff out. It's not like I'm, you know, I sit here and I, uh, this is what I do for a living is doing this kind of stuff, but I know how to do this kind of stuff. So I'm going to show you really quick because I figure, you know, this training's not complete unless I show you how to do it right. So I'm just going to do a quick border here and uh, see here picture border color I'm gonna pick bright red as it just makes it stand out a lot nicer now my image is pretty much done but I wanna here 111 pixels by 74 pixels tall so I'm just gonna actually throw this on my notepad so I can have it handy and um, that way you can have it handy too and I'll put it below the video it's going on my handy dandy notepad. Okay. So now I'm just going to go right now. So you can see, I don't know if you can see this. I hope you can. But right here you can see I need to go at least three more pixels here to get that right. So I'm actually going to stop that. But I've got 74 right. So let's just shrink it up a little bit more. If you're going to do a training right, it probably should never be that short. Because I'm actually giving you all... Of the information you need and how to do this and so you can be a Facebook pro and have leads and traffic to your fan page now I'm also just so you know just stay tuned because at the end I'm actually gonna um, recommend something so that you can start if you really want to master Facebook if you really want to master all this stuff so I'm gonna I'm gonna recommend something that's gonna help you do that so just stay plugged in with me so luckily this is a pretty nice size border here. Now all I want to do, I'm at 111 by 74. I'm just going to even this out a little bit. doesn't have to be perfect, but there you go. So I'm going to capture the image. And now I've got a nice little image here. I'm actually 
going to put it as PL for fan page so I know I can just do a search and find it. I'm going to save it and save it and then I'm going to go back to our tab here and create it. Okay, let's change our tab image. Let's upload it. We've created a nice tab image and um, we're good to go. Okay, so let's see here. We're just going to do a PL. Pull that baby up right here. Upload it. Okay, I got that. Now I'm going to just go ahead and click on Save Settings. All right, so we've got it up. It's definitely working. Everything looks good. I got a monkey face here. And um, ta-da, we've got a nice capture page here that we're able to start using for Facebook advertising right on Facebook. And one of the you know main reasons why you want to use you know the tabs for your advertising your capture pages and you don't want to just send them straight to this page is because Facebook actually hates to send traffic away from Facebook. So they'll actually like play games with you and not approve your ads and things like that. So that's why it's really important. Tomorrow we actually have a webinar with um, one of a very well-known Facebook marketer, Michelle Alpha or Michelle Pesco Salido, will be presenting um, how she actually uses Facebook to generate loads of leads and commissions on autopilot. So I'll leave a link for that. You're, it's a free webinar. You can come on and just go ahead and um, tune in and just follow along. She's going to show you how to run Facebook ads, um, do some pay-per-click, the promoted pages. So this training right here, what I just did, will definitely benefit you for that training because this is the first step is getting this stuff set up. And this is something also that um, you know, you'll have access to within My Lead System Pro. So by joining My Lead System Pro, you'll have complete access to learn how to be a Facebook marketer. I mean, you you will be a professional Facebook marketer if you join My Lead System Pro and you really take it seriously and you start implementing the training that's provided back there. And they also give you fancy capture pages like this that you'll be able to plug right in. Um, so really, really, really cool stuff. And um, that's really all I got for now. Oh, I wanted to show you one more thing because I don't see the share button here. There's a little share button that really does create some um, virality. So I'm just going to go ahead and check that box, make sure that works. And uh, this way people are able, like if they like something, they're, they're apt to share it. So you just give them the option that they're able to share this tab. And that's something I recommend you have it, having checked. So if you want some sexy capture pages or you you know need help with this or whatever, you got questions, you got comments, you can go ahead and leave a comment below or you can simply add me on Skype, April Marie 81 join me on my fan page. That's one of the best ways to get in touch with me is to join me over on Facebook. Um, that way you can just simply send me a quick message or whatever on Facebook and you know, yeah, and I can answer your questions right then and there. So I hope this training helped you and you got a lot of value here. If you did, make sure that you share it with your friends. Sharing is caring. And um, I will see you on the next post. Bye for now.